Seven drivers behind the line. Match begins in three, two, one, go! Ooh, Nelly. Wyndham placing a cone up top. Neutron's doing the same. While on the blue side, seems a few of those autonomous pieces were missed. Still, red leads 39 to 24. As 57-35 tries to play some mean defense in the midfield, drawing a penalty from the Neutrons as they deked through their substation zone. 34-67, Wyndham completes a linkage on this Red Alliance side, grabbing 10 juicy points. While 49-09 puts a cone into place for five on the blue. And it looks like someone has lost a wheel. Be that compliant roller, be that drive frame, that's never good. As the Red Alliance leads 74 to 51, Wyndham placing a cube down low, Neutron's coming in back to try and complete a hat. They put it in the cooperation grid, and wow, what a pile up midfield. Neutron's getting boxed out by the control freaks. 86-26 sets the pick and allows the Neutrons back into the substation. Fantastic defense from this control freak team. 34-67, Wyndham deeks around with a spinorama move and takes their cube to place it down low. Meanwhile, 49-09 draws the penalty from the Red Alliance for coming into their substation zone. And 86-26, the Cyber Sailors are trying to ward off this control freak team. 40-41, Iron Tigers back at their substation. Grabs another and gets ready to roll with this Red Alliance leading 117 to 102. But as we've seen it all before, everything can change with this final engagement period. It's one thing to touch the charging station, it's another thing to balance it. Red goes for three, blue tries to respond. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. It's a double, triple. comes our scores. The Red Alliance wins it 156 to 150 in a tight one with the grid making all the difference.